Hello and welcome to Champions of Kryn episode 17. Last we left off we found uh, a batch of secret doors heading towards Gargoth Keep and was subsequently attacked. My male mage went down uh, because of my other character's inabilities to hit anything and um, When we left off, I said I would try and get him back up again, uh, get him back up again, get spells memorized, and I got that done. He is uh, slightly hurt, but it's only one hit point, so hopefully, <laughs> famous last words, it will make much of a difference. But anyway, we have to move onwards. The secret door was there, so let us move through it. To the west. How are you? You are attacked by minions of Takisis. Alright. Indeed. Um, what have we got? What have we got? What have we got? We got some fighters and some bass. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Let's let's make use of it. It's if it can actually reach them. Target him. Target him. Oh, target him. Okay, two of them out. Not out, but um, disabled. And they will be out in a second or two. So. There we go. <laughs> Sit down to four dots. Hmm. One less to worry about. So we got both his swords back. Hmm. I did think she had more than a one. Come on, hit it. I would prefer not to hit those with my weapons because I'm tired of losing them. But... It's got three health and that's got seven. Thank you. Oh. Just wait and you as well. I completely forgot. That guy is in guard mode, so thank you. There you and quit move. Slings do not use ammo in these versions of the uh, game, so I prefer if I'm going to use ranged attacks in insignificant fights like this um, to just use the staff sling. I'm seriously considering whether I should trade those uh, braces of AC6 to my 
thief. Ah, surrendered. Done. God. Nope. A decent amount of experience. Um, anything special? Broadsword, 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 broadsword. No. Nothing major. Nope. Good. So, we are going to camp and then we are going to save. Um, and I'll try to fix my characters. Uh, if I can't get them healed up then I will probably reload. But I could. Good. So we save on the C. Nope. Move. This room is heavily guarded. The doors leading out are open and a party of draconians slip inside. You overhear one of them say, Let's go see Murtani. The guards attack. So, let us see what we've got. We've probably got a... Yeah. We got some Kapax and some Rogues and remember though though they are called rogues, they are actually casters. So now would be a good idea to get my firewalls oven going relatively quickly. That'd be good. Thank you. Some like it hot. Uh, uh, and you can have another one. Because uh, one obviously wasn't enough, but uh, one more should do it. Oh. Uh, I don't know, maybe. What a shame he decided to not get entangled with uh, the poison. I was about to say the acid. I completely forgot about that one. It's still up and I don't want anyone paralyzed. Don't miss. Okay, whatever you do, don't miss. Yeah, you just keep hitting, try to hit him. That suits me absolutely fine. Thank you. Quit. Done quit. The Conans are out. We start surrendering. No thanks. That's quite a bit of experience. So. <laughs> Anything out of the ordinary here? Uh, some 200 swords. Nope. Should be fine. Nope. So we are now uh, bleh, we are now outside the entrance to the keep. So first and foremost, <coughs> save and then see if we can memorize. Uh, we memorize our spells even. That might be a good idea. Did she cast any rain? I can't remember. She did indeed. Exit. 
exit yes please uh, exit come on yes please memorize no the moon cycles is uh, a cute thing I would say um, I also think it's a bit annoying but some fights you will have bonus balls and other fights you will not so we can now enter the keep a proper because we're hunting for the dragonlands so let us see what we get ourselves into you have entered Gargoth keep guards spot you on attack whoop the freaking do um, what have we got here we got uh, stuff yeah, I suppose I can't be persuaded to cast a fireball. Right around there, why not? That was a very good hit. Could give them another? Why not? Why not? Should be able to hit them all. Should be fine now, I think. So Everything becomes easier with fireballs. Trust me on that one. Done quit. Done. Got. Quit. 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 No. That was difficult, wasn't it? It's incredible what a few well-placed fireballs can do. No, I'm good. Thank you. So, as per usual, always, always safe. See if we can get our fireballs back. May as well try. Once you start getting fireballs, uh, of once you start getting your little three offensive spells, basically, whether you use fireballs or lightning bolts, um, it's not super relevant, um, but it, it makes a huge difference. Yes, please. Um, um, there's no guarantee I can invest here, but if you don't try, you won't succeed. Suppose. Ah, it allowed me to. Good. So we save and mm, time to start clearing this place out. Not here, I was uh, half expecting that. What we want to do is we want to get to the northeast corner of this area because there is a way out so we can get back um, to the outpost and get our stuff identified and see if there's anyone who needs training. Um, by finding that secret door, we will be able to go back in the keep directly from the wil from the wilderness, so no time will be lost. But move, come on, move. This is a barracks. Soldiers and spellcasters know about. They spot you. There's a yell for quiet, and a deadly hush falls over the room. A fighter approaches and demands to know what you're doing here. What do you do? Um, I've never been much of a talker. Uh, that's not entirely true, but never mind. Um, we got a handful of casters, and if I am to place a fireball, I would have to place it 
here and my ranger might still get hit. It's one of those things you would love to see. You know what, let's target the fighters. It may make more sense to... But I would rather... Because he was the one that was unaffected, wasn't he? Yep. Hmm. Yeah, well, here we go. Um, not having some sort of targeting thingy uh, for fireballs. Uh, uh, I just need to hit the casters, basically. That was some solid damage, and that fighter is paralyzed. It was that fight. They can still do some damage, but uh, nothing major. The main threat is out, so one cool blow, indeed. Manual. Just give some space. I don't think they want to fight much longer. Come on, delay. Ah, bollocks. I was going to stab him in the back. I should may or may not have gathered. So. Four hundred and ninety-one experience. Take. Hmm. Probably nothing of interest, but we can always use some extra darts, can't we? Um. Take, take. Hmm. Of course, the others were clerics, so. Just the usual. So I got two fireballs, so we should be um, well off, to be honest. So there's nothing else in here. So a random encounter. Hmm. Let's use a fire. <laughs> Sometimes I do get so frustrated with this game, uh, throwing uh, stupid random encounters at you. So I end up using fireballs against rats it's a bit. It's a bit marvelous. It's I was about to say, uh, wasteful. But it makes you feel good. I will not comment, I will not comment, I will not comment. Uh, I refuse. Come on, hit it.
Come on. Lost this weapon. What a surprise. You know what? You can probably nail a rat with your fist. If you could actually hit it, but... Details. He's out of range now. I can't be asked. You get to a point where... Um, you get to a point where you start thinking of uh, whether... Um, it's justifiable to have random encounters. Because you just... I mean, you get through a bunch of set pieces and then you still have to deal with rubbish like this, so never mind. There's a bit of money from the sh uh, Turconians. I was about to call them sea wax, but they're not entirely sea wax. So anyway, we are running over twenty minutes as per usual, so uh, I shall save the game here and end this episode so as per usual thanks for watching take care and bye bye